Hey guys, so today I have got this month's Twisted Allure box to show you. Um, for anyone that hasn't seen me open this before, it is an American box and it's $65 plus shipping. Um, I get this every single time, the shipping is quite expensive, I am aware. Obviously if this isn't the box for you that is fine, but I absolutely love Twisted Allure. So she does a lot of horror, Halloween kind of themed um, shower and bath products, she does soaps, and body scrubs, moisturizers, hand soaps, bath bombs, all different kinds of things. I absolutely love her stuff. The designs on them, they're always so, so cute and the smell is absolutely incredible. So I am gonna open this and show you what is in this month's one. Now, I did have a little sneak peek because I love getting this box and I literally can't resist when it arrives, but I've not properly looked at it. I've not smelled anything. Um, and this month's theme is so cute, so I will hold it up and try and not spill it everywhere. This is what it looks like inside, and as you might have just seen, the theme for this one is Goosebumps. I absolutely love Goosebumps. So the card is so cute, it's got little different books on it and this card does tell you what's in the box but we're not going to read off that um, and then it also has a cute little sticker as well love that so goosebumps is our theme this month this is the may box i'm not sure if i already said that or not and this is her business card in case anyone wants to go and check her out so the website email address all that stuff is on there obviously i'll put that down below in the description as well and the color scheme for this month is black purple turquoise and lime green it seems from this okay so the first item that we have in here i was so excited about because i've not had one of these from her before until i saw the scent unfortunately and that is some wax melts in the scent watermelon I just really don't like watermelon scented things. The design is so, so cute. They're like bright pink. You get six cubes that you can break off in here. Love that we got wax melts. Just not personally my favorite scent. Um, if you do like watermelon, these would be incredible. They are so strong. It's like a real um, like Jolly Rancher watermelon kind of smell just not for me but love that we got something different though so that is our first item some watermelon wax melts then next we got a bubble bath so we don't get a bubble bath too often but i don't really use it if i'm honest just because i don't really take that many baths this one is really cute though it's called welcome to horrorland and it's wild berries apple slices and vanilla which sounds amazing I love this little welcome to Horrorland sign. I kind of want it tattooed on me. Not this specific one, but like the Goosebumps one. So I think this is really, really cute. It's got all the little fairground rides and stuff around the sides of it. And it does have a little clicky lid, so it's easy to use. Um, we will open this and give it a smell. They all come with these little seals on the top. That one's quite nice, actually. It's very mild. A lot of her scents are usually a lot stronger so I'd say this is quite a weak one honestly but I guess in a bubble bath it's probably not going to be that scented it just makes bubbles in the bath. Um, the colour of it seems to be like a really dark grey I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to show that without pouring it everywhere but it's like a really dark silver which is really cool. It does smell amazing just a very very weak scent on that one so that is the bubble bath welcome to Horrorland. next we have a whipped soap and again this doesn't have a name i feel like usually they have more names on things i'm not sure if it's because it's a trademarked goosebump theme that maybe she can't name them things but um this one is pink dragon fruit anyway and it's got a creepy little head coming out of a lake missing an eyeball the color of this one is like a baby blue and lavender sort of color hopefully that's showing up and these have a little pop-up lid like this this one is very full oh smells amazing 
I've actually never had a pink dragon fruit. It's sort of giving me like a tangy mango kind of scent. If you didn't know what pink dragon fruit smells like, I would say it's mango sort of scented. Amazing though, so fruity and summery and fresh. Really pretty, love that. So that is the pink dragon fruit whipped soap. And then we have two items left, so. The next one is a hand soap. Again, I do have a lot of these now. Um, this one, again, doesn't have a name. It's just called hand soap and it's sweet pineapples and tropical citrus, which sounds incredible. It is a shiny metallic lime green kind of colour. It's showing up darker on camera, but in person, this is like a really neon bright lime green colour, like slime. Um the sound of this scent sounds amazing i will try and not pour hand soap everywhere oh yeah that's so good that really just smells like pure pineapple to me which i love so love that one i do have a lot of hand soaps now though um that one is sweet pineapples and tropical citrus and then our last item is a body spray Spray. again no name this one is green melon woods and jasmine not sure if i'm gonna love this one because of the melon or the woods i don't really like that kind of stuff but i will give it a try again super cute little design on the front there and i'm just gonna unscrew it instead of spraying it because i don't want to make chili have to smell this all day hmm I don't hate it but it is quite a masculine scent to me I am more of a fruit sweet cakes kind of smell person this one is very musky and deep and masculine so not my favorite that she's ever done but still very very cute though and I love the little designs on these so yeah that was everything that was from twisted allure in the may box this month i've got to say not my favorite one i think this might be my least favorite one that i've had in a while we had a real run of like incredible ones that i feel were just made for me this one definitely made for someone else but that is totally fine that's what you get in subscription boxes still my favorite subscription that i get i absolutely love her and i love her stuff um, so I will quickly show you everything that I got all together at once again. So there was the pink dragon fruit whipped soap. This is definitely my favourite item in this box. Love the colour, love the scent, love everything. That's my favourite one. Then next, my second favourite I would say is the hand soap in sweet pineapples and tropical citrus. I do have a lot of hand soaps but the scent of that one is so so good. Then we got the welcome to horrorland bubble bath. Again, the scent of this one is super good, just a little weaker than usual, and also I don't really take bubble baths, but still a really cute item though. Then we got the watermelon wax melts. I absolutely love that we got something different. Um, watermelon, just not for me, but they are so cute though, and they smell amazing if you do like watermelon, super, super strong. And then the last item is the body spray in green melon, woods and jasmine. Again, just not my kind of scent. It's not sweet enough for me, but I'm sure that loads of people will absolutely love it because it does still smell really great. It's just not my kind of thing. So that was everything in the May Twisted Allure Goosebumps box. Loved it as always, just not my favorite one. I am more of a cupcake scented kind of person um but still amazing though love that we got something new this month so hopefully next month we will continue to get different things um but yeah you'll have to let me know what you thought of this one down below in the comments and i hope you like this video if you did please subscribe and i will see you soon bye guys